morning everybody welcome to my saturday it is a miserable day outside it is absolutely checking it down with rain it's like 100 mile an hour winds and i have a lot to do today i'm very very busy today so i have got to go and help my nan today do a few things um i've got to clean this hole because we're not gonna we're not gonna talk about my room right now it is horrendous i've just sat on chocolate not like in chocolate i know what i mean anyway <laughs> let's move that so um i need to go to b&m i need a couple of bits from there um what else do i need to do i've got my assignment that was due in last week we've had a hell of a week with it guys like honestly it's been so so bad i did it and i was so proud of it and then I did it all wrong apparently according to my tutor so we're gonna spend today redoing that um <clears throat> and getting getting myself sorted i feel a bit gross today so i'm gonna have a shower just put some makeup on and feel a little bit more beautiful than i currently look because i look a tramp you can hear my voice is going as well today guys um i wasn't very well yesterday but it's okay you know we move we move i'm okay now so I haven't got coronavirus which is the main thing so yeah so i'm gonna tidy my room and then we're gonna have some breakfast and get started with our day So I've just spent the last two and a half hours, it's now half past two, um, on my assignment and <laughs> it's a 2,000 word assignment and I've done 3,000 words so that's great but it's fine because I've done the bulk of it now so I can just edit it tomorrow and then submit it on Monday before midnight obviously um, for the deadline so that's really good. Um, I feel like I've had a very productive afternoon doing that now. So I'm just going to pop some shoes on and then I'm going to run to B&M and Tesco because it's Mother's Day tomorrow and my poor mummy doesn't have any flowers. <laughs> so I need to go and pick those up. I think I'm going to grab a McDonald's or something while I'm out because I'm stupidly hungry. Um, but yeah, the weather's still really bad. I do not want to go out there. It is freezing. Like it is so cold, but <sighs> I have things to do. I'm a very busy lady sometimes. So guys, it is so busy. I've done, um, I've been to the post office and posted something that I had somebody buy off Depop, um, but I've got to Asda and I've literally parked at the far end of the car park. Like it, it's so busy. So I don't think there's gonna be much left for Mother's Day. Oh, look how oily. Mm, that is not a vibe. Um, and I think I'm gonna have a really hard time in here today, but you know, We'll see. Let's go see what flowers they've got for my mum. Okay, so they have absolutely no flowers. So we're switching to plan B and hoping for the best. What do they have down here? Oh, I'll definitely get her a box of Lindor because she loves them. Oh my days that was absolute chaos guys absolute chaos to tell you so the man in the car is looking at me and it's really awkward but oh well here we are so oh, i'm absolutely knackered so they didn't have any um flowers so my mum tends to kill flowers anyway so it's not too bad so i picked up a bottle of prosecco her favorite chockies and a magazine and now the magazine's not for my mum the magazine is for a youtube video that's gonna that i'm gonna film next week during the week um it's one i think you guys are really really gonna like so hopefully that goes to plan but i'm gonna head to b&m dead quick now um pick a couple of bits up that i also need for this video next week um and i'm also gonna see if they've got anything else in there for mother's day because i look like the world's worst daughter right now so let's go there 
Wow guys, that was another disastrous trip. Please ignore my skin. Look how oily it's gone. Ew. I don't know. Um, disastrous trip to B&M. It was ridiculously busy. Um, I managed to get two towels that I needed, um, but the woman was like, I, I went to ask because everyone was picking up all the things that were taped off. And I said to her, I was like, are we supposed to do that? Because... I don't want to get to the till and look like an idiot. And uh, she said to me, well, we can't tell you what is and isn't classed as essential. You know, that's for you to decide. But if you get pulled over and stopped by the police, you can get a fine. And I was like, how are towels? Like, I mean, towels, would you class those as essential? Probably not, actually. They're not really essential. I don't condone non-essential shopping at the minute. But I did need them, so I, I got them while I had the opportunity. I also went to Greg's and got a pizza and a sausage roll, but they're cold. And I picked up one of those, like, magnetic things that you can put your phone on in the car. So, that's handy. So, I'm going to sit and eat this. And then I'm going to head on home and get ready for dinner. I think we're going to have Chinese for tea tonight because it's cheat day for my dad. My dad's on a weird diet. Um, so, it's cheat day for dad. So, we're going to have Chinese or probably uh, pizza from the kebab shop. And I think... Oh, it's Saturday! Oh, Saturday night takeaway. We love a bit of Saturday night takeaway. And we've got casualty tonight as well. I cannot see anything. Um, we've got a bit of casualty tonight. So we're going to do that. I'm going to finish editing a little bit of this assignment, maybe. Um, but it's Saturday, so maybe a glass of wine and just chill, probably. Love that for me. Right, let's go home. Well, don't I look tired? Well... I'm just running a bath, guys. I've just spent... I got home about an hour and a half ago. Um, and came straight back to my work. And when I got home, it was at 2,995 words. I've got it down to 2,488. So I still have about another 500 words to go. But it's hurting my eyes. It's hurting my brain. I really don't know how to shorten it anymore without losing a big portion of information. So I've started running myself a bath. I'm going to take my makeup off. I'm just going to relax a little bit. Uh, get ready for dinner. We've ordered pizza. So hopefully the pizza will be here soon. And then it'll be time for Anton Deck Saturday Night Dickery, which is like one of my favourite parts from the weekend. But whose isn't? So kind of hoping we see the rainbow tonight because i could do with a holiday but here we are okay so slight change of plan i ran a bath and it came out like a block of ice it was that cold so we gave up with that we gave it i'm just gonna pack six um yeah we gave up with that i thought i thought it would help it obviously came out that warm and it didn't help so i'm that kind of person guys that when i'm cold right i can't get warm like it takes me so long to get warm um just gonna move you to there um anyway like i was saying once i'm cold i take so long to get warm so i think i'm gonna have to get under my duvet i've got one of those teddy bear fleece, du fleece duvets they are so so warm um it's march it's march and i still have that on so i think i might have to get into bed to carry on with my work which is a dangerous game and it's not one of my top tips for online learning in the slightest like never ever stay in bed to do work um but i don't feel like i have much of a choice because <laughs> i'm so cold but oh, i don't know i don't know I suppose we'll get that. I'm just hungry now. I'm excited for my dinner. I can't I really can't wait for that to arrive. But hey ho. Oh, good evening everybody. Oh. So that's me all done for the day. I've no idea what's on the TV. I need to put something on. 
Um, that's me done for today. I am exhausted, as you can just see from the previous clip. I've done some more work this after uh, this evening whilst I've been watching the TV. Um, so I'm all worked up today. I'm so 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 tired. Um, but I'll have another productive day tomorrow, and then it's back to Monday. <laughs> I hate how quick the weekends go. I don't particularly like how quick they go, but it's okay. Once this assignment's done, it's done then, isn't it? But yeah, so I'm going to watch some TV for a little while, maybe flick through social media, and then I'm going to go to bed because I'm super tired. So good night, everyone, and I will see you in the morning. Good morning. It's Sunday. <clears throat> Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Oh, uh, so happy Mother's Day to all of the beautiful mothers out there in the world. I am very excited to spend today with my mum, and I'm also gonna go see my nan too. My nan is in our bubble, guys, by the way. If any of you are wondering, we take care of my nan, so nan is in our bubble. So it's okay for us to go see her. I'm gonna take her some flowers. Um, I feel really like groggy again this morning. Um, I just don't think I'm sleeping very well, but I don't know. I think the stress of this assignment is driving me insane. So I'll uh, I've got a lot to finish today, but I'll be doing that later on, like not this morning. So this morning I'm gonna hop in the shower now, have a quick shower, uh, make my bed, and then I'm gonna clean the dining room for my mum. And then we're gonna go to my nana's. And I think we're gonna go get a coffee on the way. Lord knows do I need some caffeine as well. So, <sighs> shower time. So, that's me all showered, makeup done. Um, just putting my earrings in now. I'm gonna get dressed. I was gonna wear like a black jumper dress, but it's the weather's still like really, really bad. So I think it's just another leggings and a hoodie kind of day for me. I'll get my singing in. I'm just kind of chilling today, guys. It's quite a nice. Feel very relaxed. Which is weird because I'm like. Never relaxed. <laughs> like, literally, ever. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Costa. What can I get for you? Hi, can I get a hot chocolate, please? You know that medium? Yes, please. With cream marshmallows and a plate? Yes, please. No problem, anything else for you? Um, yeah, can I get a regular vanilla ice latte, please? Medium vanilla ice latte, no, no problem. And then just a regular latte, please. Just a regular latte, no problem. Anything else for you? That's it, thank you. That's real, just drive around when you can. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well guys i'm home um it's probably i don't even know what the time is what's the time it's half past two in the afternoon i've just got back from my nan's oh yeah i've just got back from my nan's we've had a really lovely afternoon with her I took her a coffee like i said i was going to she loved that um yeah she was really in a good mood today so that was good um so i'm just gonna relax for a little bit this afternoon now I offered to make my mum a roast dinner, but she's adamant she's cooking that herself, so the, the thought was there. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just going to chill for a little bit this afternoon and then watch the Dancing on Ice final later. That's going to be so good. So I will catch up with you guys in a little while. So I've just finished doing the vegetables for my mum for the roast dinner for the, this evening. Um, I'm so hungry guys, I'm so excited. I'm not feeling too great again today. Um, I've got a nice, nice hot cup of tea with me. Um, I've been feeling really like nauseous for like three days, but I don't really know why. Honestly, I drink a lot of coffee and a lot of tea. So I, I think it's milk, as crazy as that sounds. Like I've never had like an intolerance to milk or anything, but I've literally just said to my mum like, I wonder if it's milk and it's making me feel sick all the time, but who knows, who knows. So I'm just gonna sit and watch a little bit of power, I think. Um, say hi to Monkey. <laughs> He's just like, just chilling. Um, yeah, so I think I'm gonna watch a little bit of power, 
maybe have enough like i just feel bleh. i've still got to get rid of 71 words in my assignment but i'll i'll do that later on um probably while dancing on ice is on so yeah i don't know i hope you're all having a lovely day anyway and i hope every all the mums out there all the children are spoiling their mums i hope your mums are having a lovely lovely mother's day i know mine is just bored and wants to go out but lockdown oh my god the wind is literally blowing my car all over the place um mum started cooking a roast dinner and we've run out of flour so we've had to come in I've, I've just drove my brother down here i was like you go in you go get the flour i'm just gonna pull forward guys kid who stood like outside like proper scrunning some marshmallows like the, you know the really big chunky marshmallows he's like really like scrunning that <laughs> um so that's just a quick little detour around that I thought I'd let you in on. Never a dull moment in our household, I tell you. Well, people, it's that time of the day. It's Sunday evening. And I've got to do it before seven o'clock so that my results are in school. I say school, I work in a school. I don't go to school. My COVID test. Guys, if you have to do one of these, don't honestly don't be scared. They're, they're not even that bad, to be fair. Um, put that in there. There's loads of little bits though. But I think the more you do it, the more you get used to it. Like I've been doing my COVID tests for three weeks. I think this is the third Sunday. Or maybe the second. No, the third. The third Sunday that I've done it. Um, but honestly, then they're, they're really not that bad, guys. They're really, really not. My little a little test. Let's crack open the liquid. Be careful we don't spill any of the liquid though. So you just have a bad in there. And then all you got to do is do your swab. Mouth bits all done. Oh, I don't want to do this. it makes your nose a bit itchy once you've done that you put your test in here and you have to swirl it around for 15 seconds as you take it out of the tube you have to squeeze cotton swab sorry guys that's so gross pop it back in the little holder and then you get a plastic bag and you pop it in there like that then you close the top of this to make like a little pipette type thing and then you just pop two drops onto your test and that's it and then you just need to make sure that everything goes in that little plastic bag that you don't need and then you set a timer for half an hour so my it's currently 504 so at I can't do that maths. 5.34 will be when I have to come and check my COVID test because it takes 30 minutes to process. So I'm just going to leave that for half an hour now. And in the meantime, I'm going to go and grab some dinner. Um, The roast dinner smells so, so good. My mum makes a cracking roast, cracking roast dinner. Um, but yeah, I've just been sat doing nothing really. I've edited my YouTube video just done little bits and bobs but nothing exciting guys nothing exciting as always so i'm gonna go for some tea and i'll be back in a bit well guys i devoured that i must say that was absolutely delicious so thank you to my beautiful mummy for making that because it was really really lovely um i didn't finish it all because i do feel quite sick still so I don't know. We'll see how I feel, but I'm going to go and watch Dancing on Ice now, guys, and spend some, some nice quality time with my mum. Um, but I really hope you've enjoyed this week's video. I've really enjoyed vlogging for the first time. Um, I do think it's something that comes with confidence. So <laughs> hopefully the more I do it, the better I'll get at it. But um, I'm really quite happy with with vlogging in, in public. Like, that doesn't really phase me that much, so... But yeah, I've really, really enjoyed filming this week's video for you guys. I really hope you've enjoyed it. Please, please, please don't forget to head over to my Instagram and go follow me over there. This is my Instagram just on the screen here. 
and don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys next Sunday for another new video. Bye guys!